Hey, what up, gamers? We're right here at the Epic Games uh, room. It's not even a booth. I'm actually with John. We're going to be talking about Paragon. Now, I know we already talked about Paragon a while ago, but there's some updates you guys might want to check out. John, what's up, man? Yeah. All right, so first off, uh, I got to ask, for those people who don't know what Paragon is, what is Paragon? So Paragon is a new MOBA from Epic Games. It's currently in paid early access, and we're just announcing we'll have three open beta coming up on uh, August 16th. All right, so for those people who've never really tried the game, they get to try it out and... Um, and play with it because this is a very different MOBA. It's not like a lot of other MOBAs out there. We're used to games like League of Legends, Dota, and Heroes of the Storm. So what makes Paragon so unique? Well, for us, uh, we had an opportunity to build pretty much anything. It just was going, it was always intended to be a competitive multiplayer game. So what we really wanted to do is take something we felt was compelling that people would want to sort of come back to and learn. And that to us was the MOBA genre. But we had to put our twist on it and take advantage of what makes Epic great. And a big part of that is you see the differentiation in the art style. We've got an art team that is great at delivering high fidelity characters, a lot of beauty there, and verticality. When it's something where aiming matters, targeting is truly fully three dimensional. And you can see within the map, we have uh, a lot of vertical space that you can play around with. We have a sunken jungle that you can go dive into for escapes or leap out of for ganks and that sort of thing. <laughs> and it's not just click based, it's also skill based too since you have to aim. But okay, well, for, uh, for those people who've already been part of Paragon, the communities out there, I understand you guys brought a massive amount of change into, into the game. So tell me about the changes you guys have. Yeah, so our most recent update, which we just rolled out this week, is probably our biggest batch of changes that we put in any one build so far. Um, one of the things you'll see right off the bat is we've changed the way matchmaking works. So part of this was to provide not just what we think will be a faster matchmaking experience for players, but one that is more meaningful and more true to what is important to the MOBA experience, right? So the way that one of our designers put it internally is the game begins in matchmaking. Right. It's where you start to see your team comp and the draft system allows you to pick different heroes that play well depending on how the team is sort of growing as it builds one selection at a time. <laughs> well, since you already talked about matchmaking, some uh, here's a deep question for you. Competitive play. you got to talk to me about it, man. What's yeah. up with anything new with competitive play? So what's up with that? So competitive play is something that's always been a focus for us. We are a competitive game, and we want to keep iterating and making it the best competitive MOBA it can be. Um, part of what we've been really excited to see is the community just picking it up and kind of running with it, arranging their own tournaments. And it's been fun to sort of highlight some of the stuff that they're doing, their play, play of the day videos, their highlight reels. And we can do that with our replay system, and we promote that with our community team, and that's something that will continue having more of that in the future mm -hmm. as we define what our rank play system is going to be and uh, the things we're excited to roll out over time. Well, since you already you mentioned the future, what's the future of Paragon? Talk to us about it. Uh, for us, it's going to be more heroes, more content. So every three weeks, we're committing to releasing new heroes. Okay. Um, we're also updating cards as we go. So as we, we update every week, and for many of our updates, we have things like new cards and internally within the team, we're prototyping lots of different things, lots of different cards, and one of the things that we like most about that system is it lets you change the way that you play. So you can have this unique roster of characters, but on a personal level, you and I might play it totally differently because right. we have a different card pack that we've built that's based on how we play that character. That's true, and of course, uh, you guys just, I, this just came recently, the Essentials Edition, so talk to me about the Essentials Edition. What do you get with this? Because um, I understand you have a, a bunch of stuff with this already, so... Tell me about the Essentials Edition. Yeah, so for this, this was an opportunity. It was something that uh, we worked on with Sony, mm -hmm. and we wanted to provide people with a way of, you know, at a retail storefront, being able to get into the game and offer a lot of value. So within that pack, it offers different things, skins and other content, that people can grab the Essentials Edition and just hit the ground running with a great set of content to play and unlock. All right, well, perfect. Um, for those people who could get it on PC, where can they get it? Aside from, like, just the disc, where can they get these games? Oh, so as as far as this goes, with PC, you're able to download it directly, and you can head to play. You can go to the Paragon website and sign up, and you'll be able to get. You can buy early access there and get into the game, or you can wait until August 16th and play it when it enters free open bid. Perfect. Thank you very much, John, for everything. For more stuff like this, make sure you guys stick right here at Gamers Pack International. Check out our other videos. We're here at E3 right now, and if you guys you guys gotta check out Paragon. Like, it's one of the most beautiful MOBAs I've ever seen out there. And if you haven't done so yet, Essentials Edition. You guys got to get that. Once again, guys, thank you very much for joining our E3 update. For more stuff like this, stick right here at Gamers Pack International.